Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I am here with a Scentsy Limited Time Offer collection and that is the Willy Wonka collection. I have the three bars here in the collection. Now, I did not purchase this when the collection came out. It is available now if you guys are interested. Um, I did not purchase it at the time when it came out because I didn't think that the scents were entirely up my alley. But when I placed my haul for Bring Back My Bar, for the Mardi Gras collection, some other things, I threw them into that order. So I don't have the whole box, I just have the three bars. So the Willy Wonka collection, I'm gonna insert a picture up on the screen here, is $21, so it makes each bar $7. That is expensive. Um, if you just get the individual bars on its own without the box, it's $6.50 like normal for a licensed product. Um, I think that extra money is obviously going to the packaging. It's in this very cute box that's shaped like a Willy Wonka chocolate bar. Another great thing about the packaging is that it has these scent notes on the back, which I think is really awesome. Maybe Scentsy is slightly starting to listen to us. I would love to have the scent notes on the bar, obviously, but maybe we're starting to make some traction. So I would get that box if you were going to gift this collection to somebody because it really is super adorable with the chocolate bar theme, the scent notes on the back. It's a perfect little gift for somebody that loves wax, might really enjoy Willy Wonka, or enjoy these scent notes. So for me, I just got the individual bars for $6.50. Honestly, I cannot justify $7 a bar. That just seems insane. $6.50, I feel like, is plenty for me, especially since I don't know if these are totally up my alley. I will say the packaging on these exceptional the marketing the design of this could not be more perfect so like I said I have the three bars here and I've been starting I don't know if you can see my little scentsy pile here I'm on a mission to label the scent notes on the inside of my scentsy bars I I hope that this isn't a terrible idea because I'm not sure once bars start getting juicy if this is going to rub off but at the moment that is my plan <laughs> is to uh label all of my bars so i've been slowly pulling out my collection and like going through and labeling them when i'm sitting down at night watching tv or something like that but in any case i do have the couple of notes here for each one so the first one is violets turning violet and again just look at this design it is just it's perfect for this bar so like I said, I really think they did a great job with that. So this one is blueberry, white cherry, and sugar. And I don't care for this one per se, <laughs> but I don't like blueberry. And this also gives me, I smell the blueberry. I feel like I get a hint of cherry as well. But to me, this pulls grape bubblegum. I get a grape note and I don't know if it's like the cherry mixed with the blueberry, but I get like a grape hubba bubba bubblegum. Yeah, this one's definitely not for me. I might try to melt it or I might pass it on to somebody. I don't know. It's very, very sweet, very candy-like. Reminds me a little bit of like a box of nerds, you know, those little nerds that are like all multicolor. So yeah, not for me, but if you're into candied scents, if you're into blueberry, if you like grape, if you like bubble gum, if you like those sweet kind of artificial sugary, give you a cavity type set, you would really enjoy this one. So that one is a violets turning violet. Next is fizzy lifting drink. Guys, one of these days I'll get my camera to focus. I really need to get a new phone, but project for a different day. <laughs> Fizzy lifting drink is orange, grape, soda, raspberry, and vanilla. So orange, grape, soda, raspberry, and vanilla. 
And I definitely get the grape here, but it's much more minimal. This is sweet. This kind of reminds me of like a Laffy Taffy, like a strawberry Laffy Taffy. I enjoy this one. I do wish it was a little bit more fizzy. Um, I'm looking for more of a effervescent note and that's just not here. Yeah, I really don't get any sort of effervescence at all with this. So I wish that that would fit kind of the name a little bit, but it's a very sweet scent. And I'm really getting like a strawberry <laughs> Laffy Taffy, which is weird because that's not exactly in the scent notes. Maybe it's that raspberry that's pulling it. But again, it's very candy, very sugary, sweet, kind of give you a cavity type scent. I definitely will melt this one. I don't think I need more of it, but I enjoy that one on cold. And then the last one in this collection is Everlasting Gobstopper. Again, the packaging is just so pretty. So this one is Orange Pop, Sugar, and Tangerine. This one is definitely a very orange scent. I almost get like a creamsicle type vibe from this. Sweet orange, you get that vanilla. I think that's what's giving me like the creamsicle-ish vibe is that vanilla. Or like an orange push pop. Again, not my scent preference, not totally up my alley, but worth a try. This will be really pretty in like the heat of the summer. Orange is not my favorite, but I do tend to enjoy orange in like the heat of the summer. It's really hot. It is a very cool kind of refreshing scent. So I enjoy that one. Again, don't need more of it. None of these for me are going to be repurchases unless they like just totally blow my mind on warm, but you never know. So my favorite is the fizzy lifting drink, then the everlasting gobstopper, and then lastly the violets turning violet. But that's it. Those are just my quick kind of, I shouldn't say first sniff because they're not my first sniff, but let's say cold sniff impressions of the Scentsy Willy Wonka bars. Curious if you guys have picked these up yet or what you think about them. Um, I'm like having a hard time keeping up with Scentsy's LTOs, so... This video is probably way outdated at this point, but hopefully you got some enjoyment from it. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.